Hi girls, happy Friday. I have a quick tip for you today to send you out into the weekend with. Um, I always love cruising the clearance at Target because you kind of never know what you're going to find and typically I can wait things out until they're on clearance like if I really really want something. But something I never plan on purchasing but I always find it in the clearance aisle is or are tablecloths and the reason that I love them so much is I really usually dig a couple of them that Target has. Target has really great solids and then they also have fun prints um, from time to time and they always go on clearance at the end of that season. Sorry I've been shaking the desk a lot just now. Um, anyway and so I was at Target the other day not intending on purchasing this but as I was cruising that back aisle where all of the end caps have clearance stuff on them the one wall that had all of the tablecloths, like half of the wall of tablecloths was all in clearance. And when I'm talking clearance, I'm talking $5.48 clearance. And I have purchased them for cheaper than that, like $3 before. And this was last, I want to say last Easter-ish, or before Easter or something like that. Anyway, so I picked up two. One of which I knew exactly what I was going to do with the other one. I haven't decided yet. But this is the threshold. Hold, please. Hello? Oh, I'm not. I'm, I'm, it's like more of a hello. Well, hello. Hello. How are you? Oh, you're such a beast. Good. Everything's everything's good. We okay, love you. Bye. Okay, so back to the tablecloths. So this is the threshold line. The tag has the clearance tag on it. I don't even know, you're not even able to see it. But it says threshold. It's kind of like a fancier looking Thing with a key. They've been having it like in our section kind of on the back closer to the furniture. It's kind of all those really nice pillows, throws, ta and table, tchotchke, coffee table item. That like the threshold brand. But they do have the linens as well. So anyway I'm rambling. I picked up two. This is the cotton polyester blend. I think it's like 60 or 70 percent cotton and then the rest polyester so it's nice it's it's got a good weight to it and uh, the other one does too they both are like linen-y but this one is more has more texture like a woven and this one looks more almost like a silk linen blend if that makes any sense uh, so anyway this one is a gray a really nice gray with some texture and variation and then other one that I picked up has been magically transformed into pillow covers. So all I did was we have had these chuck up brown pillows for a really long time. Long story short, I've had them since we lived at Fairchild and have meaning to recover them and and meaning and meaning to do that. And this is not like the end all be all, but it is a temporary solution that didn't cost me anything. So I made two huge pillow covers. I mean these are big pillows, like a huge pillow the size of my head and I have a big head. So I covered both of them for $5.48. Now granted I had the other pillow to cover but you get what I'm saying. Like it's an unbeatable deal. It's a heavy weight uh, material so it's more like um, like home decor fabric at the fabric store. That stuff starts maybe like at $15 a yard or something. Which is not a bad price for like good heavyweight fabric. I mean, that's expensive. But if you can get a yard and a half plus two yards of it for $5.48, you can't even get regular nasty fabric for that cheap. I'm just saying. You're not going to be able to. So, when in doubt, buy a tablecloth. And all I did for this was just, you know, a square on the front and it's like an envelope closure. So, you cut two rectangles that overlap enough. In this case, I overlapped 
maybe like six inches or so and you sew everything together on the edges and flip it right side out and voila shove your pillow in here so anyway my point is just don't underestimate the power of any clearance item at Target let alone tablecloths because not only can they be great tablecloths they can be pillow covers and they can be drapes if you were to pick up two of these these are 60 inches by 84 inches so plenty to cover one window but if you wanted to pick up two so that it would be a nice pair you would have drapes for eleven dollars you cannot beat that price and all you would have to do is is fold it down a few inches and sew then you'd have a pocket to put your curtain rod through or I mean there's a lot of other things you could do to use them as curtains but that's how simple it would be and then you would have curtains for nothing and they have the cutest patterns sometimes I mean I would love I would love to get a set of them to put in here and I actually went to cost plus uh, two days ago to look at their drapes because everything's on sale right now because I really would love some like fun drapes in here I mean this is the office this is the guest room there doesn't need to be serious at all and all I have is white drapes which is fine but it's kind of a snore in here and they were I mean they're expensive it's like gonna be like forty dollars which is not a lot of money for drapes but for us it is forty dollars for drapes I can't do that right now but I could do eleven dollars for drapes and they didn't have any at that Target that I went to that would have been good. Um, but you know what I'm saying? Just always be on the lookout. And they have tablecloths everywhere. I mean, TJ Maxx, Ross, whatever. Even at Pottery Barn and stuff like that. Like, if you're just always in the mindset of looking at things, not as necessarily things, but as materials, then there's a lot of things you can use to make it happen. So anyway, that's just my thought for the day, and I kind of wanted to share it because I think it's a really good one, and hopefully inspire somebody somewhere to do something.